Hey guys, if you're interested in seeing how to achieve this natural hairstyle with side swept curls, keep watching. To achieve this style, I used this Shea Moisture Shampoo, this Subaki Blossom Organics Conditioner, a wide tooth comb, you can use a brush of your choice. I love these hair combs, I use them all the time bobby pins and optional gel. So I'm starting with freshly washed and conditioned hair. I did not rinse out all the conditioner this time. I left the conditioner in. So the first thing I'm going to do is flip my head forward and kind of move my hair in the direction that I want it to go. I'm using my fingers to comb through my hair or you can use a brush like I do here to smooth the hair and move it over to the side that you want it on. So once you've got it on that side, you just kind of want to play with your hair until it looks how you intend for your hair to look in the final stage. So I like my hair on my face, so I made sure that I had bangs. After this, just continue smoothing and smoothing your hair until it is laying how you'd like it to lay in the back. Once you've finished doing that, go ahead and take your hair comb and you're going to begin placing your combs. I like to start at the bottom and work my way up. Once that first comb is placed, you're just going to Take a brush or your hand and smooth out your hair a little more before you place the next comb into place. You can see here that my combs aren't perfectly lined up. That's okay. The way that my hair falls, it covers it up anyway and it doesn't make a difference. But if it really bothers you, you can always take the comb out and place it again. So you're going to continue with this process and keep on moving up and placing combs as long as they are needed. Once I got to the top of my head, I noticed that I didn't really have space to put another comb and have the style look how I wanted it to. So I decided to just kind of twist the hair only to make it more secure and taut before placing a bobby pin in that place to hold it. So after that, it's really just about playing with it until it looks how you want it. If there's a part that doesn't look right, just use your fingers to fluff it or move it around until it looks how you desire your style to be. So at this point, I wanted my hair to be a little more smooth and also to have a bit of hold on the side. So I chose to add some Eco Styler Gel using my fingertips and then Smoothing it out with my small brush. This step is completely optional, but that's just how I like my hair done. And at this point, my hair is still damp, but this is generally the style. So I decided to let it dry before I came back to show you guys what it looked like. So this is the final look after my hair dried, and I love how it turned out. Hey guys, it's Taya. So that's it. I hope that you enjoyed this tutorial. If you guys like this kind of video and would like to see more of it, please thumbs up this video or leave a comment below or both to let me know uh, that that's what you want. I will catch you guys next time.